Hey guys, what's up? It's Molly. Back in another video. And if you're new to my channel, hit the subscribe button. If you're not new, hi. Welcome back. So, I was picking out my clothes. And then, after I picked out my clothes, I put them on. And then, like, literally right after I put them on, I was like, oh my god. I was supposed to take a shower first. So dumb. I usually never take showers in the morning. So, yeah. I think that's why I forgot, but, yeah. Um, so, today, as you guys can tell by the title, and maybe the thumbnail, I'm not sure. But, today, I'm going to be doing a acting class. I usually do it every set, no, not every Saturday. Um, Saturdays, but it moved to Sunday. So yeah, so this acting class is just like the businesses of acting. So yeah, so it starts at 11 to 2, 11 to 2. And yeah, I'm gonna take a shower because this hair is not looking cute today. And I just, I'm not gonna straighten it because I don't feel like it. Um, so I'm gonna take a shower to let my hair get wet and uh yeah so yeah because this hair is not looking cute like look at this like why is it poofy bro okay so yeah i do not want to go on the meeting like this and by the way it's on the zoom meeting so yeah oh and my mom's going to join in because they said that she has to um just for like 10 20 minutes but yeah so i'm kind of nervous every acting class i get nervous <sighs> but yeah i don't think today we do scripts because i think they're just going to talk about acting business so yeah okay i'm gonna take a shower because i'm talking too much and i have to be out the shower before 10 30. um well, actually, before 11, but, like, mainly 10.30, or before 10.30, but, yeah, because, you know, yeah, okay, so I'm going to right now, and, yeah, and by the way, my mom's nervous about the, like, business of acting thingy, mm, but, yeah, okay, I'm going to take a shower, so, yeah, I'll see you guys after, I'm going to do a cute trip, oh, wait, oh, no, not yet, okay, so I just got just for no reason. Look at this. Okay. So I'm gonna do a cute transition, maybe. Um, so yeah. What the heck is this? Oh um, okay. Ready? Set. So this is my outfit. Um don't I mean I do know what this is, but I don't care. Um this is paint from ninth grade at art class and you know I just got it on here or whatever but it's fine it's just paint um I don't know what matching is but I don't know if this match or not but I don't know okay so this is my hair when it's wet so go ahead and check out my night routine video I just posted it in the middle of the night because I, I can't breathe. I wanted to post it Saturday, which was yesterday, but uploading got kind of difficult. Um, so yeah, it came up at midnight, which was like two or three um, or one, something around there. But yeah, I don't know what I just did. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna brush on my hair. And my hair might dry by the time the zooming starts because my hair dries pretty fast. Okay, so I'm not pushing it out that much because I don't want it to get unwet. Hmm? I don't want it to get dry. I've almost gone with this. This makes my hair so healthy. Yeah. So, 
these are the two the two huh? these are the two shampoos I use oh god for the shampoo I use this coconut one and for the conditioner the same one these smell so good so yeah okay so I'm gonna put my hair up So I'll see you guys later. Um, I'm gonna go downstairs to eat a burrito maybe. And yeah, I'll see you guys later. So, this is my burrito. And I always cut it in half because I don't like it a whole burrito. This is how I cut it in half. I know it's pretty sloppy, but oh well. Um, and then I just cut it in half. Who's watching me? I use tapatio. I mean, <laughs> I use rooster. Red rooster. Not, I mean, it says specifically red. So, red rooster. Okay, red rooster. So, I just put it on the side. This is how I do it. This is a burrito tutorial, okay? Do more money. I just like do that. You guys probably think it's disgusting, but. Ah! You guys probably think it's disgusting, but no. Okay, just try this and you love it. Okay, so you take your burrito, and then with this burrito, it kind of got hot sauce in it because the hot sauce went to my burrito. But <laughs> yeah. so you take your burrito. Okay, I'm saying that too much. Okay, let me just eat. And then you dip it. Okay, like that. And then you take a bite. But when I eat, I have to watch YouTube. So. My ear itches. Okay. So, yeah, this is so good. Say hi. Hi. Say hi. He's busy, though, guys. I don't like, like, if it's, like, one long piece, if that makes sense. I don't know. I just like it when it's even, like this, boop, but yeah, I'm probably making no sense, but mm. so yeah, I'm gonna watch YouTube, okay, so I have my hair up, obviously, but we have five minutes until it starts, and I'm pretty nervous, so I have it on the laptop, but I don't know if it's gonna work. Um, so I have it just in case it works, because it would be better on the laptop. But I also have a phone, because this is waiting. This is waiting for the host to start this meeting. So, I don't know if you can see that, but yeah. Yeah, leave it in real quick. Because why? Like, and if I can, like, hear it again, so it's okay. Okay, you ready? Get on, why are you getting first? Okay, there it goes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They can see that,
dramatic TV film commercials, just commercials. There's also print agents, which is, um, you know, magazines, you know, print work. Um, some of the agents, I know both, both of the agents in Michigan are across the board, so they do all of that. Um, so depending on what type of job you book through your agents, you will pay them a commission from what you gain, okay? So let's just say your agent sends you off on an audition for you know, a you know, virtual for sprint, and it pays a thousand dollars. If you book that job, your agent will usually get anywhere from ten to twenty percent, um, based on what type of job. Print work is usually closer to twenty. TV, film, and commercials are ten percent. Okay. Um, most agents the, will take that right off the top, and then you get your check separately. Okay. Um, for minors, if you are under eighteen, uh, you also need to get a student account. Parents, this one is. Uh, pretty important for you guys this is how your um, child will get paid okay so um for like elizabeth miley uh, michael all of you younger ones a coogan account is a trust account that's a portion of what you make by law is put into a trust that nobody can tell your age like um offer it um you're just gonna ask them for a blocked trust um, I, again, that was one of the handouts that was sent to the Coogan account. Okay. Did you guys receive that? Do I need a Coogan account? No, because the, um, the time yours is set up, sweetie, you'll already be 18. How do you spell Coogan? C-O-O-G-A-N. Did you guys get that handout? That uh, um, attachment in the email? I, uh, will I need an entertaining work permit when I'm 18? No. Yeah, you won't see, see. I got the Coogan thing, but it didn't have Michigan on there. Okay, um, it's going to talk a little bit. Uh, Michigan, most banks will have it. Um, California, New York, and Louisiana, and New Mexico have just a different oh. setup. That's why. Um, you're just going to want to go to your bank. Um, some smaller uh, credit unions might not offer it. Um, Will that Bank of America does. I'm on a Pretty sure um, PNC does there, too. Okay. Can everyone hear me okay? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. There's a lot of background noise. I think some people still aren't muted. Yeah, if you guys um, aren't talking, if you could please go ahead and mute for me. I'm muted. Okay. Um, so, Coogan Law, we kind of went over that. That's very simple. I'm under 18, you'll need to get this set up so your agent that that you'll need this to get paid. Um, actors access, uh, like I said, I'll be sending off that an uh, email that'll have a bunch of different websites you'll want to get set up on. Actors access is hands down the most important. Okay. Um, so parents, if you guys don't have an email set up for your child, you you'll want to do that now um, or today at least before you do the actors access. Because you'll want something easy, something with your name. If you guys have a crazy email, you'll please, I mean, for agents, they want something clean, with very simple. Your name is usually the best thing, okay? Um, does anyone have any crazy kind of emails? Oh, everyone got it. Okay, perfect. <laughs> I know it's kind of hard with the background. Um, it'll make more sense once you get this in the email, and I will send, it, like I said, a better one today so that everyone can really have access to it and be able to fill it. Okay. Um, what else here? This is kind of, this is my first time doing a business class online, so I'm usually showing you the website, and it's kind of weird to not be able to on here. So I'm going to. Dan, I have a question. Sure. Um, for the experience section? Yeah. You need one that's done in middle school and elementary school, too? Yes. Absolutely. Because right now, you want to add as much as possible to to the resume because the agents want to see what, what you've done, done, what you're good at. And it's going to help them, you know, decide and, and help them down to send her out on auditions. I don't need a work permit or a Google account again? Correct. 
Stacy, because you're going to be 18 in, you know, a month and a half. So and by the time you're placed with an agent and start going out on an audition and you get paid, you'll already be 18. Well, once I'm 18, am I just still considered a teenager or? <laughs> I mean, your age, yes, but depending on what type of job the agent is sending you out on for an audition, it'll okay. they'll, you know, go over all of that with you when the audition comes up. I have a question regarding um, cover letters. You know, um, can you collaborate on cover letters for the resume? Do you need that to showcase at all, or no, is that no. only when it pops in line? But you're not going to need, need a um, cover letter at all. Um, um, your resume is actually going to go on the back of your headshot. Um, actually, let me grab one for just a second. I'll show you exactly how it goes. Mm -hmm. One second. Okay. So here's here's my doctor's headshot. Um, when you're ready for the showcase face to face, you'll ha you'll need to have a printed headshot. For the virtual one, you're just, we're going to send it electronically, um, but it will be on an eight by ten when you do get them printed. Name on the front, white border, usually a half an inch to an inch. Your resume will be on the back of your headshot. Okay, so no cover letter. If, um, it's just the one page, so you'll want to fit as much as possible on that one page of the resume. Uh, one question. What about, like, stage names? Like, your name, like... Like, we're, uh, like this is my teacher's last name, Brudenhammer. Um, like, they might not like that, and they might want to change it. Uh, what, what do we say? How do you find your stage name? Okay, um, well, at this point, you're really not going to need one. The, the first thing is to get placed with an agent and then start booking some jobs. I, as of right now, and I would just use your name. Like my real name, XIA, like my real last name? Because yeah. it sounds kind of hard to say. No, that's okay. You're going to need to know your real name. Anyone downloaded our app? Yes. I, okay. I have. Okay, perfect. Um, on the app, you can also register, and it will give you the ability to self-submit for the <laughs> Um, if you do that, it does take a, about a day for the registration to be completed, and you'll get a, um, a separate password that gives you access to um, the auditions that you can self-submit. Okay? Um, you will do that via email, and that is something that to be able to self-submit, you're basically bypassing paying an agency fee, like the 10 to 20%. So um, it does, it's a $23 a month, or I think... 159 for the year if you want to be able to self-submit to our app, okay? Um, after today's class, um, those of you that have registered will then get access also to um, more auditions where in the VIP section of the app. Uh, you'll have access to that after today. Elizabeth still needs the monologue class. It's the only one class she has left. Okay, perfect. Um, we'll be, I'm not sure when the next one is, but obviously she'll need to do that before her showcase. It's at the showcase you're going to be performing your monologue yeah. for the agents, okay? Um, okay. Um, I want to say it's going to be the next couple weeks because I do want to have one before next showcase just as a brush up. Yeah, I have on my calendar that there was one offered May 4th, but that was before all this COVID stuff started, so I don't, I don't okay. know. Okay. Um, if it's on the calendar, we'll still probably be having it. It's just going to be virtual like this. Okay. Um, um, can you give me the list of the classes like the different types of classes again mm -hmm. absolutely i'll go ahead and send that off to everyone too so let me make some notes here so um list of classes okay you know um i went over the work permit for california for michigan like i said earlier your agent for those of you under 18 um when you book a job not just you don't need a work permit to go on an audition in michigan you just need the work permit once you book the job but your agent and that production company will file it once you book it because it's individual uh, specific for each job does that make sense okay perfect wait uh sorry can you repeat uh, is that over yes okay um you're not that's gonna be for michigan minors oh, if um getting a work permit yes yeah, so you don't need that one Absolutely, sweetie. Okay. Um, does anyone else have questions so far? Uh, yes, I have a question. Okay. Um, 
So for the Studio Group app, um, if the, I'm getting a lot of notifications for different states. I'm in Michigan, um, so I know this on the app, so I still be able to submit for yeah. those files. Absolutely, um, and a lot of them right now when you're even submitting, they're filming from. It'll say that um, they'll have like a director assisting filming if you book it. Uh, quite a few stuff and most everything that's being filmed right now is filming from home or someplace um, that they can help direct. But it's definitely worth submitting for. Okay, so I. Are there other websites you recommend or like. Yes, I mean, actually. Access is a big one. Um, Casting Frontier. LA Casting, IMDb, and Backstage. I, again, I'll be sending you guys the, right after we're done an email that will have all of those websites. And um, Actors Access is just the one that's mandatory for an agency. That's the only one that's absolutely mandatory for you guys to sign up for, okay? Wait, don't they need, uh, don't they need uh, the, 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 the picture, like our picture? Yes, um, well, just to yeah, need like they need a professional headshot photo to like actually get on with us let us like do the shoots for actors access uh actually for all the websites i've been on they like want professional photos okay um well some of you already have them some of you don't and as soon as we get those taken we'll be you know get those to you immediately um in the meantime you sh should be able to sign up with just a regular you know just a snapshot of yourself right now I would, you know, just add something for the time being. Oh, okay. Uh, how do you join an IMDb? IMDb is, um, that one is, uh, it's pretty easy. IMDb.com or IMDbpro.com and then it'll say to log or to set up for an account. Just like, just like all the other ones, when you go in there to set up an account, um, it'll, it'll just walk you right through it. Okay. Sign up for Facebook. <laughs> right. Actors Access does have a lot of information they're going to ask you, though. Um, they're going to want to know your sizes, what type of activities you enjoy. Um, it does take probably about 20 minutes to do that one. All right. So definitely set, the, set, set time aside for when you do that, okay? Um, you send all of this on email? Yeah, so I'm sending this all via email as soon as we get off um, when we're done. You guys all obviously emails work. Got the login for here, so I will just send it off. Um, like I said, probably about 15, 20 minutes. Okay. All right. Okay. Um, and then so this week, I want you guys to um, work on your resume. Like I said, I'm going to send that off first. It'll be separate than the other emails. Um, if you have any questions, please text me. Um, I can definitely help you anytime. And then I want you guys to work on your monologues. So next Saturday, I want to go over your monologues with you and help prep for showcase, okay? Um, for Elizabeth, I know you don't have monologue yet or you haven't done that class yet, but I want to say we'll still do that. I still want to go over it with you or help you pick one, okay? I have a question. Sure. Who's that? Um, Christian. Okay. Hey, Christian. Um, you said the resume you want us to fill it out what if we don't have a picture at home um, is there a way we can like do it on the line yeah it should be and the way i'm gonna send it will be a um, word document so you should be able to just um save it to your desktop and then open it and fill in the information just for a place where it says name with your name okay okay yeah it's usually pretty easy as a word document mm -hmm. okay. And, okay. again jenna it's claire okay um, you repeat the cost. You said that the studio group app. You hear me? Yes, Gerald. Okay, cool. You can hear me. Uh, I don't want to get ahead of everybody else, but I was wondering if you were going to talk about SAG, Screening Actors Guild. Um, I will be. I want to go over it a little bit more next week once uh, we go over a resume and whatnot. So. Okay. Okay. And how to become a member of SAG. Um, okay. And when it's important for you to do so. Okay. All right. Okay. Um, can you also send the app to me? Vicky Yang. Vicky yes, of course. Thank you. Of course. Jen, I have one more question. Sorry. No, 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 no. Maybe a dumb question. 
Yeah. She's had her headshots done. Mm-hmm. And um, we never got them in the email. But once we do get them, what's the best way to get them professional? Uh, to get them printed. Um, there's a place I've used in Michigan called Allegra Printing. They are on, um, gosh, I need to hear. They're on the Telegraph. They're on the 10, I want to say. I can send you the details for them. I also have a great um, printer here in California that you just um, email him your headshot selection and he will get them printed and sent to you overnighted very, very quickly. He's great. Um, you can super, super cheap prices too. You can print, um, I want to say he does copies for $50. Um, Jerji Tosco, Christian Beard, Thomas, Thomas Moser, Linaya, what's your last name, sweetie? Naughty. Anthony Garcia, Michael Dow, Kayla Forrest, As you guys, as you guys heard, if you watched like the whole thing, um, you guys will catch it. Um, but she said this one is only an hour. Then the next one is another hour. So the next one we're having is next Saturday, which is only for an hour, because she said this one's only for an hour because we're doing construction work at her house. So yeah. So the next one's an hour. So basically, it's two hours um, for this one and the next one. Plus two. Okay, yeah, you know what I mean. Um, so yeah. Okay, guys. So right now I'm just eating this hot stuff. I and I'm pretty sure you guys already know, but I love hot stuff so much. Like you guys have no idea. So yeah, I'm eating this salsa. This is like the best salsa ever. So I eat it with tortilla chips. <gasps>
Well, I was gonna end this vlog today, but I feel like I'm just gonna end it. But I'm just gonna wait until Saturday because next Saturday is the second part of the business of acting. So I'm just gonna wait until next Saturday so I can have two parts of the business business of acting in here so yeah i'm just gonna wait till next saturday to finish this video so yeah my tongue burns and right here right here so yeah so i'm just gonna see you guys next saturday and yeah i'm gonna edit my afternoon routine in a little bit after i go on tiktok but yeah Oh my god, I'm so clumsy. But I'll see you guys next Saturday. Bye! Hey guys, what's up? So I just noticed that I didn't do a proper intro. So I'm doing it right now. So, yeah. So I'm doing it right now. But just pretend like this is before the like audition or like the acting class. But yeah. So hey guys, it is day two of the acting class. The half of last weekend's. But yeah, so today I'm just going to be doing the other half of last week's, but just the other half. And today I'm going to be doing my monologue in front of the like person that's like directing it, if that makes sense, coaching, coaching it. Um, she's going to listen to me perform my monologue, and yeah, sorry guys, but um, she's going to see me do my monologue, and then... That's basically it. Um, that's basically all we do today. She goes over the monologue. We perform our monologues in front of her. And she goes she goes over sag and stuff like that. But yeah. See you later. I'm gonna join it, I'm scared. It's oh shit. Okay. It's 128. Oh, it says right there. I'm so done. Okay. Okay, so tell me what kind of stuff do you like to do? I like, write it down while I look at the paper and I'm so happy about that. But I'm not going to worry about that. Grandma, have a boy all day. You love what? Grandma, have a boy. So you probably didn't hear me from that clip. Um, because I was talking so low. But what I was saying is that I had to do another script. Because my script, I had a Mingo one. And the like host or coach, whatever. I don't know. Um... She said that I had to do another one because Mean Girls is like too known. So, like a lot of people do that one. So a lot of people do that. So, and I got a script from Euphoria. So, yeah. So I did Euphoria. 
I didn't record me doing the monologue because I needed my phone to read a script. But I didn't read the before the script. She's gonna send it to me later. Well, she already did right now. But in there, she's gonna send it to me later. Um. But yeah. So I was reading the Mean Girls monologue. Um. But yeah. Zuri, okay, that's a good one. I think you relate a lot to her. I think she, she you kind of remind me of her too. It was, she's the same girl that was on Jesse, right? Because when she was little, she was on the walkway on the beach and a little bit of beach from the walkway to our building. We can go sit down there, but the, like you really can't like do too much. So, like you can't go down in the water. It's not warm enough to you know more emotion and more realism. So, and this is a tip for everybody. Agent to be able to send you audition. So you know, let me go to my, let me go to my. Read the ball. Hey guys, have a great rest of your weekend. Um, so Miley and Lania, I will be talking to you guys in a, in a couple hours. We'll work on finding you um, some monologue options, and then um, I will send all of you guys a link to join the Zoom monologue class tomorrow if you want to. Okay? Thanks, Jen. No problem. Have a great weekend. Bye. class at 10 15 and this I think was longer we start at 10 15 and it was at 1 15 so are you guys talk in the comments about my sweater yes I was wearing the same sweater as the day before but you know it's not a shirt it's a sweater I don't know what it's called but it's not a shirt um so yeah and also, I watched it the night before. Like, after the like meeting Saturday, I watched it after that. So, yeah, don't comment about that. So, Jen, that's the video I talked to about the acting class. If you have any questions, stuff like that. And she's the person I gave the payment to. So, yeah. So, she sent the monologue. Because if you guys don't know, I need to change it. So she's in the monologue from Euphoria. <coughs> so I just itch in my eye and it's like lower than it was like it's ugly and it's red. Oh my god. It's itches so bad. Oh my god, that's so ugly. That's so ugly. <sighs> we start in like, I don't know. What? 13 minutes? No, no. 10 minutes? I mean, okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. She's in Kendra Slow. Actually, the senior here of her county. Okay guys, so I literally have one minute and I got distracted because I was looking for the picture of my phone. Um, wait, what am I doing? I 
guys, I'll probably go ahead and let you guys get started. It's about 10, 15. Um, okay, perfect. The background, um, feedback, we will go all here, you know? Very cool. Okay, I pull up. Hop out at the after party. You and all your friends, and they love that getting naughty. Sipping on that eat, I know you love that McCarty. 1942, I'll take you back in the world. Okay, I pull up. All right, guys. So who are the last two that just joined? All right, well, I'm going to pop out. If you guys need anything, let me know. Please text me, and then I'll come right back over to my computer, okay? Thank you. All right. And off to you, Devin. Have fun. Oh, perfect. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Um, so, just as Jen said, if you could, um, until you call LeBron, and I'm going to have my screen. I'm going to try as large as I see everybody. I think I have everybody in my view right now. Um, some of you guys I recognize from the LA class, and then I know some of you guys have joined us from Michigan. Hope everyone's doing well. I know this is crazy times. Um, so to get started, I'll call people individually. Just tell me your name and what has been your favorite like media, whether it's like a TV show or a movie that you consume since the start of quarantine. Uh, and I'll let you guys know my favorite when I am when I hear everybody's. So let's see, I'll go like in order of where they put you guys. Um, Eva, could you unmute and tell us, and also tell me a little about yourself too. Hi, um, my name's Eva. Um, I'm 17. Uh, well, actually, no, I'm 18. Um, <laughs> oh, happy birthday if it, if it came up recently. Oh yeah, um, thank you. Um, and I live in Michigan. It's really nice outside. Um, okay, let's see. Oh, and then I know this person. Miley, if you could, tell us about yourself uh, and what you've been watching. My name's Miley Gamez. Um, I'm 15. I'm from Winter Park, California. And I've been watching Euphoria. You've been watching? Oh, uh, wait, what have you been watching? Euphoria. Oh, Euphoria. Okay. Okay. Uh, I, guys, I teach in the LA class. I feel like Euphoria is a very well quoted show. Like, you guys tell me about it so much that I still haven't seen it. I've got so much stuff to watch. I'm so sorry. Dragon Ball Super? Yeah. Nice. I honestly have no idea what Dragon Ball Super is. I just want to say thank you so much. Alright. So, guys, I just put the links um, to the Google Drive file. Okay, guys. Did you guys didn't get the email? No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Yes, I did. It's a uh, monologue preparation. The blurriness goes away in a couple seconds. What the heck is this hair doing? Yes. Guidelines. AM. There's an attachment. Our tools. I was always taught you should always have two mm -hmm. monologues. Uh, well, actually four, but two comedic and two dramatic. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Two, mm -hmm. three. That's like two three, links, maybe six, out of the same thing. Seven, or something. Right. I don't so know. Two yeah. separate ones. Bunch of links to monologues. Uh, I, I saw it in Jen's email with the two handouts. So definitely look at those. But, yeah. Then get the email. Uh, well, okay. at, at so the end of the class, we'll be sure to Sorry that it didn't come through for something. Right. Right. I'm going to tell myself you definitely want to point your career to something that's known and less public. Okay. Like, You ready? All right, cool. Let me put you in speaker view. And then uh, before I meet mine, please give us a slate and then tell us uh, uh, your name and where your monologue is from and then take it away. And I'm muted. My name is Miley Gamez. I'm 15 and I'm doing um, 
Euphoria. One, two, three, four, five. The other thing about depression is it kind of collapsed time. Suddenly you find your whole day, your whole days blending together to create one endless of suffocating loop. I will never end for the rest of my life. Hey guys, <coughs> so I'm in a meeting with my class, but oh my god, my hair is crazy. The reason why I was not forming my monologue is because I, in there, I didn't watch the episode yet, and I didn't know how she says it, but now I watched the episode, and now I know how she says it, so that's why it was like slow at talking. And I just got right. the monologue right. that morning, so I didn't really pr practice it Good. that much. Um, but yeah, that's the reason why. So don't mind that. I have a bad habit of forgetting to unmute myself mm -hmm. when I'm talking back to you guys. Uh, good job. I think yeah, that was a lot to get through, and I know I haven't seen you for it, but the clips I have seen on Twitter and on YouTube, uh, it's a very wordy um, show. Like, there's, there's a lot of voters, there's just a lot of, um, sort of, uh, what's the right I'm thinking of? You wrote, uh, The West Wing. Uh, I, I, I can't believe I'm, like, blanking on his name. Very famous writer. But, like, the show takes a, takes, sort of, takes a bite from his, sort of, writing style. Um, so it's a lot to try and ingest. I think you can you know, I definitely want to, like I'm telling everybody, I want to see a take later in the week where, you know, we're not in class, we're not in a fixed like, time. So talk to your parents, take a day or two to really ingest it and like try to remember what was going on in the context of that scene and send me a tape of it so I can give you like a full breakdown of like ways to improve upon it. But that was a lot. And I know we're just doing readers today. Great job. But again, please take take the uh, um, take my email and get your parents to help you record it, and then send me another take of it. At least wait till Wednesday so you could digest it, and then I will give you feedback more in depth than what I can give you today. But great job, Miley. Okay, thank you. Do 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 do. So right now, I know my biggest thing because I'm moving it, but you might get on the but um. So right now I'm just gonna practice my lines and I'm gonna like do this way that like I always remember memorize my lines if I do this. So right now I'm gonna memorize my lines because I have to get it down in two days because on Wednesday I have a self tape and yeah. So I'm gonna remember memorize my lines and yeah, I'm gonna do self tape and I'll, and I hope and I hope I remember to do a vlog for my self-tape. Hopefully I do. But, yeah. So today is Thursday. No, it's Friday. It's May 8th. I don't know why I just showed you the date. So I got to the end of editing and I just realized that I didn't do an outro. Like a proper outro. So I'm doing it right now. So... I hope you guys enjoyed this very, very, very long video. This video is 50, like an hour long. Oh my god. So Zavina's, she's like, um, there's acting videos. I'll link her, I'll link her channel down below. Or videos, I don't know. Videos or channel. Um, but her videos are like 10 minutes long. And mine is like an hour. What the heck? Probably because it consists three days. I don't know. But like, oh my like God. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did like, subscribe, comment down below what other videos you like to see next. And also stay tuned for my self-tape that I'm going to film later today. And yeah, see you guys next time. Bye!